JDownloader can download files from Usenet. In this video we will look at how to configure NZB Donkey to send NZB files to JDownloader and start the download. There are some prerequisites that need to be fulfilled to follow this guide. You need an active account with a Usenet provider. If you don't have one, check the video description for some affiliate links to support this channel. This account must already be configured in JDownloader. You need a MyJDownloader account. You can get one by registering your email address. All links are available in the video description. Once these steps are completed, we can start configuring NZB Donkey. Ensure that your JDownloader instance is connected to your MyJDownloader account. You can do this by entering your email and password in the JDownloader settings. Now, open the configuration page of NZB Donkey in your browser. Here you also need to enter your MyJDownloader account credentials. In the Add New NZB File Target, select JDownloader and enter your MyJDownloader credentials. After a click on Test Connection, a list of devices appears. You can connect several instances to your account. Make sure to select the correct one. Now we can intercept an NZB download and send the NZB file to JDownloader. To make this work you need to have NZB interception configured. Check the info card for more information. After a click on a NZB file, a dialog from NZB Donkey appears in which you can enter the name of the download. This file name will then be used in JDownloader. The download should now start immediately. Thanks for watching this video and happy downloading.